Hi everybody, today we're going to do improper and mixed fractions. So let's look at what these are and how you work with them. First of all, before we're going to do that, I just want to make sure that you know how to locate all of these fractions. So when you look at this with me, see if you can locate them at the same time that I'm doing this. And if you can, just sort of point on, on your computer screen or your tablet and sort of, or, or just figure out, okay, that's where she should go before I even go there. See if you can work with me with this. Okay, very first one is one quarter. Now let's look at this scale to begin with because it's asking for a quarter. Is this in quarters? Let's find out. Between the two and the three, there are one, two, three, four intervals four spaces, so they are in quarters. And we can count anywhere in here. We should be three, three and a quarter, two quarters, three quarters, four quarters. Okay, so one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Those are in quarters. And look, these are all in quarters, so it works out nicely. So let's do this. The first one says one quarter. So you start at zero and the distance, one quarter of the distance is one of these little intervals. So there is one quarter. And I'm going to put that right on top. Okay, now let's find three quarters. Well, three quarters would be one from zero. It's a distance of three quarters of the way to one. So let's do one, two, three. So that one is three quarters right here, right before you get to that one. Okay, now the next one, so we've got those two. The next one is seven quarters. Let's start at zero again because it's a distance from zero to seven quarters away in the positive direction. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is seven quarters right here, seven quarters. Okay, now let's do 11 quarters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You could have just started there, really. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. So there's, right here is 11 quarters. Good. Oh, let me come back to two quarters. Well, two quarters is going to be right between the one quarter and the three quarters, so let's just write that in right away. I know that right away because when you count, it's one, two, three. So it fits right in between. So one quarter, two quarters, three quarters, okay? Before you get to that one. Now, you've got 13 quarters. Well, rather than starting right back here, I already know where the 11 quarters is. This is the 12, so the 13 would be right here. So 11, 12, 13. So this one is 13 quarters right here, okay? Now we go back to the eight quarters. Oh, well, I can start with the seven quarters here. Now I'm going to double check because maybe I made a mistake with that seven quarters. And it's always good for you to think of that too. Let's just go back and double check to make sure that eight quarters should be right after the seven, seven, eight. Let's go and double check, start from zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes, it is. Eight quarters is right on top of that too. Ha, that's pretty cool. Okay, notice four times two is eight. Hmm. Okay, and now 25 quarters, oh boy. <sighs> well, I'm going to hope that this 13 is correct, okay, in this time, or I'm just gonna go back and double check. Let's double check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, that 13 is good. Now to go up to 25, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. It's the tick right after that six, and that is 25 over four. Good, I've done all of those. Now, the next question says, circle the improper fractions above. Well, what's an improper fraction? An improper fraction is any fraction where the numerator, the top number, is bigger than the denominator, okay? So let's go through, and I'm going to circle this in red, all the improper ones. So I see one quarter, 
Well, the one is smaller than the four, so it's not improper. Three quarters, the three is smaller than the four, so it's not improper. Seven quarters, oh, the seven is bigger than the four, so that's improper. Eleven quarters, that eleven is bigger than the four, so it's improper. And two quarters, that two is smaller than the four, so it's not improper. Thirteen over four, oh, that thirteen is larger than the four, so it's improper. Eight over four, it's improper. Eight is larger than the four. And 25 over four is improper. That 25 is larger than the four. Now, let's go back and look at these ones. Seven over four is right here. Look at that. 11 over four is right here. 13 over four is right here. Eight over four is here. And 25 over four is here. Huh, look what happened. All of these are improper. They were all above the one. And all the numbers underneath the one, between the zero and the one, are proper fractions. The improper ones are bigger than one. So we're going to do some more and you're going to see why and what happens now. Okay, so let's do another example. This time we're going to do on this scale is in fifths. If you see from the one to the two, you have one, two, three, four, five. Five different intervals, which means that you have it in fifths, and all of these are in fifths. So I'm going to quickly go through this, and you're going to work with me again, please, and see if you can find all of these points. So the seven fifths, well, that would be one, two, three, four, five. Remember, it's five up to one. So if you know that, I can do five right away, five. So, and then I can do six, seven. Seven fifths is right here, okay? The next one, nine fifths. Okay, I'm at the seven, eight, nine, so I can do that one quickly, nine fifths. Six fifths, okay, so there's five up to the one, and another one makes the six, six fifths, and that's right before the seven fifths. Twelve fifths. Well, I'm at 9, 10, 11, 12. So this is 12 fifths. Now, think about this. This is 5 fifths, so this one will be 10, 11, 12. There's the 12 fifths, okay? Because every time you get here is 5 fifths, another 5 fifths, another 5 fifths. So 5, 10, 15 fifths, 20 fifths, 25 fifths. 